Hello, little soldier. Finally given up. I can tell the way you're backed up against the wall is a clear indicator of the fear you're feeling. I must say I'm impressed you've lasted as long as you did, certainly longer than your friends. But you already know that, don't you? After all, you watched me kill them. You saw me make trophies out of them, stalking them through the jungle, picking them off one by one, until the last one standing were you and me. And the whole time, you never knew who was doing it. You never saw the face of your hunter. Until now. <laughs> Surprise. I've seen the same expression a thousand times on a thousand different worlds, human. The prey is always so shocked when they see the face of their predator. Especially when they realize they're from an entirely different planet. That they're being hunted by an... And how is it your kind say it? It makes a point to learn the tongue of all the species I hunt, but some of the words still escape me. Ah, uh, yes. An alien. That is what I am. Just as much as you are an alien to me. Oh, don't raise that weapon. I've been in your shadow for hours, watching your every step. I know you're out of ammo. And given the difference in our species biology, there's very little you can do to escape me. I am stronger than you. I am faster than you. And I know for a fact I'm smarter than you. After all, your men would still be alive if it wasn't the case. And the only reason you're still breathing now is because I'm bored. I could kill you at any time, the same as I did them. But my extraction shuttle isn't due for a few more cycles. And I need something to do in the meantime. I need something to hunt. So it might as well be you. What am I saying? <laughs> I know I'm speaking your tongue correctly, human. Perhaps unclog those ears slightly. What I'm saying is, you might have thought our little hunt ended when I cornered you, little soldier. But it hasn't. I'm offering you a very rare chance my kind never gives. An opportunity to live for a few more hours. In our tongue, it's kumakya. But your kind, I believe it would refer to as a second chance. So go. Flee. Run into the forest with your tail tucked between your legs. I'll give you a head start. <laughs> Do actually try to test my abilities this time, though. I'd hate to end this hunt too quickly. Did you think you'd give me the slip hiding among the trees, crouching among the branches? I bet you thought you had a nice vantage up here, an easy way to see where I was coming. But from how you tensed up, you certainly weren't expecting my blade at your throat. <laughs> I love the look of fear in my prey's eyes when they realize just how outclassed they truly are. And I wasn't even using my invisibility shielding. <laughs> In fact, I haven't used it once this entire time I've been on this planet. 
It's just how unobservant your kind is. Speaking of your species' lack of observational talents, I must ask, human, do you recognize where we are in the jungle? Or do all these trees look the same to you? I only ask because... <clears throat> that was a good swipe, human. In fact, I think... Blood? <laughs> long were you hiding that knife there? I didn't even notice. Seems I underestimated you. You actually cut me. <laughs> I love it when that happens. Still, though, you're playing your winning card too early, I think. It would have been better to save it until you were certain you could kill me. Unless what you're hoping for is an actual fight. Though I'm absolutely positive that's a fight you'll lose. Do you want to die, little soldier? Is that your way of atoning for what you did to your men? For how I killed them? <laughs> There's the anger. The fury. You're not the shaking coward in the cave any longer. You're the warrior you were born to be. The warrior you should be. And it was I that brought that out of you, the thrill of the hunt. Hold on to that rage, little soldier. Nurture it, but don't use it just yet. There's something I want to show you first. Do you recognize the space we're in? I know many of these tree branches look the same, but breathe. Focus. Take a moment. Is there anything about this place you recognize? <laughs> yes, yes, this is where you and your men made their final stand. It was only a few hours ago, but I suppose to you, it must feel like an eternity. Oh, you're wondering what I did with your friends' bodies? I already told you, soldier. They're my trophies now. They're not far, but you wouldn't want to see them. Or maybe you would. Maybe I'll bring you out of your shell and finally help you defeat me. <laughs> In that case, look up. Yes, there they are. Dangling from the trees, decorating the jungle, food for the birds a much greater purpose than they ever served in life. Doesn't it make your blood boil seeing them like that? Seeing how you failed them? Perhaps you need a closer look. Here, the body of your lieutenant, I believe you called him. He seemed very dutiful, a good friend, always following your orders. Too bad that's what got him killed. Yes, yes. Take a moment to mourn if you must. Take a moment to crouch by his body. Close his eyes, but don't forget... <laughs> clever, clever little soldier. I didn't think to disarm your friends with their weapons, and you certainly seized the opportunity to use them, didn't you? Unfortunately, though, once again, you wasted your chance. After all, you only wounded me. And you should never wound what you can't kill. After that, I think I'm done playing with you now. I'm ready for this to be over. Drop the pistol. Re-equip your knife. These are the last moments of your life, human. And they shall be spent in close combat with me. No doubt, the greatest honor of your existence. A moment most warriors daren't even dream of. My kind has quite the reputation, you know. Your world is one of the few that haven't heard of us. Do you feel braver with the knife? Is it bringing your courage out? In truth, your weapon is hardly a match for mine. These Shrahmor blades are easily three times the size of your knife. Sadly, it seems it shouldn't take too long. 
Hmm, I suppose I'll have to find another way to spend my time once I'm done with you. But don't worry. A true hunter always makes sure they kill their prey quickly. Now, prepare yourself, human, because it's time to die. What? What is this? You're laughing? Why is that? Some kind of hidden ploy, perhaps? I don't find the situation particularly amusing. In fact, I find what you're doing quite undignified, human. I take back my respect I might have granted you, and I demand an explanation. I suggest you give it. It would be the difference between a quick death and a slow one. A radio? Stolen from your friend's body like that pistol? No, they still have theirs. Which means you've had this on you the whole time. Those hours spent in the cave? You weren't hiding. You were calling your superiors. For what purpose? Requesting an extraction, perhaps? Hoping you can still escape the fate that befell your men? No, that doesn't sound like you. You seem more than willing to fight me. Any lesser men would have tried to run, but you've never given up. Never stopped looking me right in the eyes. I see. You were calling in a bombing. Hoping to wipe me out. Take me with you. Very clever, human. Very clever, indeed. I take back what I said about you wasting your opportunities. You've held the winning card this entire time. <laughs> Once again, I reminded that I have underestimated you and am proud that you make good use of it. Given the speed of your terrestrial aircrafts, the amount of time since I found you in the cave those bombers should be here any minute, shouldn't they? <laughs> but that means they're not here yet. Which means there's still enough time, human, for you and me to conclude this hunt and settle our differences. <laughs> no, I won't run. Like yourself, I am no coward. My kind longs to meet an end such as this, and given the opportunity, I am more than happy to burn in the fires those bombers will bring around us. You are worthy prey, and I am a worthy predator. There is much honor in this hunt. <laughs> now pick up your knife, and let's get this over with. <laughs>